We should make a movie about cryptids. No way, that's absurd. You've never been able to tell your side of the story. If I could just record you not killing people, then people might like and trust you. What do you think about the idea, Key? The way I see it, I ain't got no ideas. So we have to go with your idea because your idea is better than my idea, which is no idea. Key, can, can, can I talk to you in private? It's your thing. Gil and I walk over to the other end of the clearing, far enough not to be heard. This is the dumbest plan I've ever heard in my life. And I've lived a lone life. Choosing to trust people could be worth it. That's easy for a human to say. Maybe all of this has been part of a ploy all along. Really? Really? So you don't, after all this, you don't trust me? An elaborate scheme to gain our trust so you and your friend could make a movie. Really? Really? Look, I'll tell you right now, if I wanted to eat fish, I'd be eating fish. You'd be in a frying pan. You'd be so cooked. After everything, I thought we were friends. It's because I rejected you, isn't it? Gil, I know you're worried, but I put myself in physical danger to help the cryptids multiple times. I've kept your secrets up until now, even from my family except Kit. I told him. But other than that, I kept your secret and didn't tell anybody. I only told Kit. Gil looks at me clearly conflicted. Without another word, he turns away. Oh, so it's like that. I find Gil floating in the water, seemingly enjoying himself. You've come back, human. Oh, 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 okay, okay, so I'm a human now. I don't have a name? Okay. Okay, merman. Gil looks in my direction with his eyebrow raised. Man, I can raise my brow too. You ain't doing nothing special. I know it's a lot to take in. I should have talked to you before Kit came to the woods to propose his plan. I'm sorry. No, I was out of line. You have been good to me and the cryptids. So I'm the one who should apologize. I'm on board with your plan, Key. It's not even really my plan. It's Kit's plan. We're on board with his plan. Do you want to be the first human to see my kingdom under the springs? Is that a rhetorical question? Because you know my answer. Then take my hand. I do as he requests, gently lower myself into the- Oh my goodness, I'm going to drown. With a wave of his hand, Oh, an air bubble forms around my head, allowing me to breathe underwater. Oh, I, yo, I thought I got the bad ending. I thought he was trying to kill me. The sight takes my breath away. Or maybe it's because I'm underwater. Maybe that's what's taking my breath away. Maybe the air bubble is not working properly. Welcome to my kingdom, Key. I can't believe this was under the springs all this time. Yo leads me to his private chambers. The walls are lined with weapons and interesting artifacts. I swim over to the table and look at the small glowing orb. What's this? A small glowing orb. The Octopian Peace Orb. It's all about peace. Is it just me or is it weird that in his room filled with weapons, he has a peace orb? It was given to me as thanks for stopping the Asopodopian invasion. Is that why you got the weapons in here? You stopped the invasion with the weapons and then they gave you a peace orb. <laughs> You got into a scuffle, and then they said, you're really good at keeping the peace. <laughs> He's amazing. You have this entire life I've never known about. It's not just the cryptids you want to protect. It's this world, too. Now you're starting to understand. I don't understand why you didn't get it sooner. I told you I was a prince. There's something else I wish to discuss with you. Would you like to accompany me on a stroll through the Coral Gardens? It's quite beautiful and secluded. Oh my goodness, he's going to kill me. The sound of his voice makes my knees... He's going to kill me! Oh my goodness, he doesn't, act, he doesn't trust me at all! He's pretending that he trusts me, but he's going to kill me because he doesn't trust me. The way Gil looks at me makes it clear he'd like to do more than just talk. Like, he, he wants to kill me. That's what he wants. He wants to kill me. Oh, I can just go home? Okay. I, I appreciate the invitation. Show me your kingdom. But it's, it's really wonderful. But, but I gotta I, I got get home. I like being alive. The days have been crazy lately, and I'm sure my uncle is worried about me. Kill size. I, I, I understand. I, I wasn't going to kill you. I'm 